Alright, it's time to open up some packages. I've opened up most of these, so I'm gonna have to go to Valkyrie's Rage. This is the new pack added in this update, and here we go. They also give you a thousand gems if you haven't been playing Yu Gi Oh! Duel Links. They give us a thousand gems so we can, um, you know, purchase cards. Alright, here we go. Sinister Seeds. When a monster you control is destroyed by in, or by a battle in which you took damage, its face up attack position at the start of the damage step and when it was destroyed, special summon one sinister seed token. Plant dark level 100, defense and attack for every 500 battle damage you took from that damage in that battle. Oh, this creature. I don't really care about that creature. Ooh, the agent of wisdom Mercury during your standby phase if this controlled if you controlled this face up card, no cards are in your hand at the end of the opponent's last draw phase. Draw one card. Okay. Alright, we're gonna go all in for a uh, ten right now. Boom. Five hundred coins, let's go. Hmm. Chaos seed. If you control light or dark monsters, you can target one of your banished light or dark warrior type monsters. Add it to your hand, you can activate Chaos Seed per turn. Ooh, a Chaos Seed. When this card inflicts battle damage to your opponent's life points, draw one card from your deck. Ooh, Shinobird Crow. Cannot be special summoned once per turn during the player's damage step. When this card battles another an opponent's monster, you can discard one spirit monster until the end of the battle phase. This card gains attack and defense equal to the attack and defense of the discarded monster. Once per turn the end phase, if this card was normal summoned or flip, flipped up face up. This turn, return it to your hand. Okay, another one. Ooh. Okay, so another one that cannot be special summoned. Return it to your hand. Normal some face up. You can target one face-up monster your opponent controls, change the battle position, okay. Negate all effect, equip card effects on the field. Hey, that's really good. Okay, I see this in Kaiba's, uh, Kaiba's deck. Boom. A player cannot attack face-down monsters during this turn. Okay. Resurrection of Chakra. Hey, the Naruto there. Use this ritual summon, chakra. Okay, so it's a ritual summon. If ritual summon if you ritual summon a dark ritual monster, this one card will be used as the entire tribute. Oh damn. That's really good. Hmm. I took a little time to open that just, just for the effect. Remove and play one card from your opponent's graveyard. I'll go this, this Gradius. Veil of Darkness. During your drawing phase, if you draw a dark monster, you can reveal any number of them. Send them to the graveyard, then you can draw one more. Wait, during your draw phase, if you draw a dark monster, you can reveal any number of them. Send them to the graveyard, then you can draw one more. Okay. I don't have a lot of dark monsters, though, so... Chances are it may not really happen. Monster recovery. Target one monster you control that is owned by you. If you if that monster is still on the field, shuffle it and your entire hand into your deck. Also after that, draw the cards equal to the numbers you shuffled from your hand into the deck. By this effect, you cannot activate this card if you have the card in your hand that is owned by your opponent. During your standby phase, increase your life points by 400 for each monster on your side of the field. Okay. Angel 07. With this, with this card, when this card distributes something, it gains the following effect. The effect of monsters cannot be activated. Okay. Well, that had an ability on it. Oh. All monsters can use control gain 200 for each remove from play beast type wing monster. If the equipped monster attacks a defense position monster, inflict piercing damage to your opponent. Oh, this is an equipped. 
Very meteor crash. Okay, we've got all three of them right here. Ugh. Twin-headed wolf. When there's a face-up fiend monster on your side of the field, negate the effects of flip effects destroyed by this monster. Flip effect monster destroyed by this card result of battle. Activate if four link or higher. Select one monster, either player's graveyard, special summon. You can not activate this card with multiple card effects. The same name are in chain. Okay. Ooh. Ha! Whiptail Crow. It's 1650. That's good. I already have that. Ooh, Luminous Soldier. If this card battles with Dark Monster, increase the attack of this card by 500 points during the damage step. Hey, it's only had 3, 4, 5, it's only 5, but hey, if it fights a Dark Monster, it gets a 500 boost. Mm. Spell Reclamation. Discard one card in this chain. Uh, chain this card to a spell card you activated. Where the spell card is sent to the graveyard, return to its owner's hand. Okay, this, so this is another, um, individual monster. Who flip. Your opponent draws three cards. Both players look at the cards. Your opponent draws three cards. Both players look at the cards. If any spell cards are among them, discard all those cards, spell cards, to the graveyard. Yeah. Okay, come on. <sighs> okay, another one of him. Skull layer. Remove from play any monst number of monsters in the graveyard to destroy one face of monster on the field whose level is equal to those of the numbers you removed. Shinbird Praying cannot be special summoned and another spirit monster normal summon the monster is on the field you can draw one card once per turn during the phase you normal summon and flip return to the hand. Okay, okay that was it. Okay. So just for good luck, we're going to um, purchase the little fishy here. Or I probably should have picked a different one, but let's see how this game works. Ooh, new right when to get up. Destroy all your quick cards on the field. Nice. Inaba White Rabbit. This card cannot be... Okay. This card returns to the owner's hand during the end phase of the turn. That is the card of normal summon. Oh, flip, flip, face up. This monster attacks your life points directly. If this card battles a light monster, it gains a thousand attack during the damage step only. Okay. So it looks like I got some really good cards. Um. Just, just for giggles, I'm gonna open these up too, just to, because they're on the next update or something, they're gonna take out this, ooh, ooh, ah, okay, oh, yes, I've wanted this card, ooh, Henshin is action unit, pay 1500 life points when you target one monster in your opponent's grave, you're a special summon that target on your side of the field, face the position, fifth card, when this card leaves the field, destroy that quick monster. Okay. So we got some really, really, really good cards. Alright, so. I'm gonna prepare that and stuff, and, um. Maybe show you guys what the card dealer has real quick. Not really anything too good. You know, it's good drill monsters and stuff, but, um, this is what he's selling. Oh, of course, the keys, you know. You got the keys. Alright, though. Alright, this is Pharaoh, and, you know, this is, um, you know, Yu-Gi-Oh! opening up cards, and also, you guys, the Xenoverse 2 update. Don't forget about Xenoverse. Alright, so I'll see you guys later.